Hello Taurus, this is the Beetlejuice playing card deck. This is my first night trying to do tarot readings with a playing card deck, but I'm enjoying it. Um, if you're a fan of Beetlejuice, you understand why. Anyway, the center of this reading is talking about taking control of a situation, taking risks, trying to recover a situation. If you look at the faces of what's going on there, you might be doing a lot of um, used car salesman tactics, or this could be someone doing this to you. Trying to be charming, trying to persuade another person. To come to the dark side joke. That's not Beetlejuice. Anyway, but yeah. So, it looks as if you could be feeling overwhelmed about a situation. The burdens could be very heavy. Some of you could be shocked about what's going on. And it could involve family, potentially, or a marriage, or something like that. Somebody could have been juggling people, or this could just be that you're juggling thoughts or feelings about a situation. Because there is deception. You could be feeling confused. Or someone could be creating an illusion here. Because... Somebody is being resourceful here. Taking control of a situation, taking risk, trying to recover a situation. For some of you, it's a fading marriage or a partnership of some sort. You're being cautioned because some of you could be acting on emotion that you're going to regret. You're being cautioned to not get entangled in the pettiness of the situation. Because some of you are being confrontational wanting to win at all costs could be backstabbing that kind of thing. Trivial, the trivial parts of this you need to avoid. Don't get so caught up in the deception that you become the deceiver. And it kind of looks like that's what's happened. You may have been deceived in some way. But rather than walking away from the deceitfulness, maybe a new beginning, starting over, fresh, you're rehashing the past.
trying to get revenge, that kind of thing. All right. So if this reading resonates with you, please give it a thumbs up. Feel free to share it. And if you're not already subscribed, please do. And I'll see you again soon. Bye.